Scott from Pennsylvania. Uh, one long time wrestler, Bull Pain Shoot interview. On long time wrestler, Bull Pain Shoot interview. He talked about uh, how your dad stole his wife. Is this true? If so, what are your thoughts? Well, let me tell you how this story really goes. My dad used to fuck his chick. Her name was Samantha Payne, Donna Shepard. She was 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. My dad quits fucking her, my dad grows up, my dad grows old, I grow a teenager, I become a wrestler. So I start fucking this chick. I don't know I'm fucking this chick, but my dad used to fuck. Fucking this chick about three or four years, she's an undercover agent for F for fucking Metro Narcotics Departments in fucking DeSoto County, Mississippi, and I'm smuggling marijuana by 20 pounds. Remember when USWA went to Dallas, Texas and joined the world class? Yeah, yeah. At that time, I was snub muggling 20 pounds of marijuana underneath that fucking bus. Because you had the in duffel bags. Texas, yeah, I didn't yeah. give a fuck. I got fucking 20 pounds of pot for 300 bucks. I was taking it back to South Haven, Mississippi, selling for a fucking five dollars a pound. Give me 30. I didn't give a fuck. And if they pulled the bus over, there's 37 people on this bus. It ain't my pot. Anyway, I can tell you that now because it's 2009. So. Bull, I bring Bull Payne home. He steals her from me. He marries her. And my dad comes by. They get a business again. My dad starts fucking her again. My dad steals her from Bull Payne. Bull Payne flips out. Anyway, me and Bull Payne just drew big money at XCW for the last eight months. And my buddy Mitch Ryder fired me from XCW because I was fucking his sister and her husband found out. And he, you A lot know, of fucking going on in the Dundee home. No, in the South. It's like it's what you South. do. If you can't get no beer, fuck. <laughs> Dave Petros. You know, I read them all uh, here, so... We're I gonna, fucking love read them all. We're going in, Dave's. Here's one more question for that bald-headed midget. How the hell did you and that goofy midget of an old man of yours see over the top rope when you were in the ring and you both tagged together? Uh, did you sit on his shoulders, you silly hillbilly bastard? You get a lot of, you get a lot of shit like that from people trying to... I guess not in person, right? You know what that means in my talk? God damn, I loved you. Can't wait to see you next week. That's right. I swear to God. Say say all that again. That's right. Say it again, yeah. right now. Bald headed midget, how the hell did you goofy old midget of a man see over the top rope? Uh, did you tag together? Did you sit on his shoulders? You silly hillbilly bastard. That means I love to get away to see you again next week. I mean, honestly, you never been to your buddy and said, You stupid motherfucker, I love you. Yeah, yeah. I'm goddamn beat your ass this week. Can't wait to see you, you stupid motherfucker. And then you went off, right? All right, I got you. That guy right there. So that guy right dirty. there. Matter of fact, I bet he cussed my grass. <laughs> I bet Dave does. Term of endearment. All right, let's check out what I Bill... I love Terms of endearment. That's my favorite movie. Let's see what Bill's got to say. Hey there, Jamie. I know your dad and Jerry Lawler had an illustrious feud together, but what, I want to get down to the heat of the matter. Was your dad mad he wasn't used as either cheesy, queasy, or sleazy? Give me a break. Oh, he popped on the midgets. I love that. Yeah, that's, I guess that's my fault. Go ahead. Let me answer the question. Let me put it on. We got a very important quote. We got a very important question about... Hilly, Billy, and, uh, and Silly there. Oh, yeah, so important that you went hillbilly silly. Fucking rewind it. If he's wrong, this goddamn interview's over for fucking 15 minutes. We're out of beer. We got so much stuff here. Let's Hang on, I'm getting the fucking text. If it's from Vince, we're gonna read. Hello? Hello? Hi, Bill Dundee. Hey, it's Bill Dundee. Hold on, Bill Dundee. I'm doing my shoot interview on the internet. There is over fucking 200 questions here, Bill. And most of them are about you with the bullet <laughs> circus in 19... I said, look, I don't fucking know. I still lived in his deck in 1965. Why are y'all asking me? So here, you talk to the man running the show. He's paying me big money, but I'll give you a hundred here. <laughs> hey, Bill, that's really Fuck yeah, it's Bill. Like hey, I'm going to lie to you. Nigga. I don't know you no money. Know, Motherfucker, like I'm going to lie to him. Yeah, we're working with your boy, and he's, uh, he's doing a heck of a job.